What's good, team exclusive, and welcome back to some more FIFA 21 content. Today, we are going after some of those uh, best of team of the week cards and some of the uh, hopefully higher rated team of the week cards in this current team of the week. Um, first things first, of course, today is Black Friday. This you'll probably see this uh, day after Black Friday, but uh, they released uh, a bunch of uh, what are they uh, record breakers. Very nice looking cards, there's only five, so there's of course as you see Mbappe, you've got David Silva, you've got Sancho, Falcao, and then Oscar, some very, very nice looking cards, you can't argue with those at all. Um, of course they're in packs, so they probably are going to be quite unobtainable, however, I do think uh, they've given some players some really nice boosts, uh, Oscar wasn't too usable before, looks like a really good card now, Falcao the same, just really quite slow before, now actually looks like a really good striker, um, same with Sancho again. Had a bit of a bit of a you know a, a pace downgrade, but he's got you know he's got that straight back up again. Very good looking card. David Silva the same, and then Mbappe of course is just Mbappe with an incredible shooting boost. Um, yeah, in in incredible stuff. Of course, this is the best of the team of the week. I've worked out there's I think 24 or thereabouts in total team of the week cards in packs, and uh, I believe 18 of those are walkouts. So we are hopefully in some sort of um, Good standing trying to get them. Got some new objective players. Got uh, Rodrigo, looks like a really good card. Actually, not too difficult to get. Of course, got a new Black Friday uh, objective as well. Some nice pack rewards, two mega packs, premium gold pack, and a draft token pack with another premium gold players pack. So, very, very nice stuff there from EA. Um, no new milestones as far as I'm aware. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it. There is an Aguero SBC. Do you want to quickly show that as well? Because I think uh, even though it's very expensive. I, I I think it's actually quite a nice thing. Um, oh, that's actually just popped up as well. So we've got a new... Uh, that actually wasn't there before I started recording, but there we go. So we've got a uh, triple upgrade. 81 plus triple upgrade for three gold rare players, 81 rated or higher. Uh, it's there for just 24, 23 hours. What do you have to do to complete it? You need 11 rare golds. That's actually not too terrible. To be honest, it's a bit of a kick in the ball to everyone who did the 81 double upgrade, but it is what it is. This one's a bit, it's a bit ridiculous. 83 plus double upgrade, and you have to get rid of 82 or higher, 10, minimum of 10. Uh, and 83 or higher has to be a minimum of 5, so it has to be 5 82s at least, with 5 83s as far as I'm aware. As far as I'm aware, that's how you have to do it. I mean, you can't have 15 players in the squad, so that's uh, how you have to do it. Um, yeah, a bit of a rip-off, I think. 83s are going to cost you probably, like, you know, what if we say the lowest, maybe 2.5k each. Um, what, so five of those, that would be 2, 5, 7, 10, 12.5. Was that right? 2.5, 5, 7, 10, 12, yeah, 12.5. 12 okay, right, so mass is correct, but 12.500 coins... For that, and then you get 283 plus higher. I mean, I don't know. I just don't think it's worth it. Um, Sergio Aguero, on the other hand, a very nice looking card. 84 rated squad, 85, 86, and 87 with just one team of the week. So actually not too terrible. Um, the packs back are complete garbage. As per the EA just literally don't want to reward you for doing any of these SBCs. But he's got a nice upgrade. Good pace upgrade. Uh, he's always had good shooting, good finishing, dribbling's good, you know, physical's good, and passing's actually quite nice for a striker. And a Premier League striker, uh, flashback, I, I think he looks really good. I think it's really good. Um, four star, four star, he could be worth doing, to be fair. Again, maybe on the little pricey side, but I, I think for what you're getting out of him, he could be quite, uh, quite worth it. Packs back, they're not worth it, obviously, as per. But onwards with the video. So... That's everything that's in the game. Got some brand new content, which is really nice to see. Um, you really love to see a, a load of content being pushed into the game. Uh, got stuff to play for, got stuff to work for in the SBCs. Uh, you got, obviously got stuff in packs, so if you do earn packs, you've actually got stuff that you can pack. Um, it's just a good time to be on FIFA, really. And I'm hoping we can get some of those. So first one, we've got one of the Flash SBCs. It's a rare player's pick pack. Can we get something nice? Oh, we get a Dharma Triori. Is mine tradable? I think mine's tradable. Uh, so we'll go with him in the hopes that mine is tradable. This one's tradable anyway, so it doesn't actually matter. He is going for about... Still going for about 3k. Crazy how cheap a Dharma Triori is. But 
not the best, not the best. We have eight Team of the Week packs in store. I'm hoping, I'm hoping we can get at least one walkout out of eight would be really nice. Um, you know, I'm not gunning for, you know, Cristiano Ronaldo or, oh, yo, in Dombele. He doesn't sell for anything like his uh, Spurs French partner does, but uh, Ruben Diaz as well, quite nice. So, um, yeah, I'm obviously not gunning for like the, the Messi and Ronaldo's, but um, getting anybody that could be um, slightly usable would be would be really nice. That's actually quite a nice ball. Um, crazy, crazy. Anyway, right, let's start off things with a good, good start. Walk out for our first team of the week player pack. No messing around, just jumping straight into it. No walkout to be somewhat expected. Probably should have watched that. Not that I really care. You get Perotti. That's actually not a bad one. Um, 82. Could be worse. Could definitely be worse. So next one, second one. We've got uh, five left. No, six left to go after this. So we've still got chance. It's not a walkout. Just going to skip it if it's not a walkout. Get through this slightly quicker. And we get, yep, Mancosu. Mancosu. Marco Mancosu. Now he looks kind of well-rounded for a 79, but uh, not really usable. Come on, come on, yeah, give us, give us one walkout, make it a big one. Obviously, best of the team of the week is, as I've mentioned, in packs. Don't get a walkout. Wow, these are really paying out. Get American goalkeeper. It's going to be. I think I've already got this guy. <laughs> I think I've already got this guy. Yeah, is he tradable? He's not. Wow, that really, that really sucks. That really sucks. Come on, five left to go. I spent all of last night building these for this. No walkout. Jesus. So, out of 24, we had 18 walkouts. We can't hit any of them. Good lord, that's another Perotti as well. I saw the Argentina flag. Damn. Four left to go. Come on. I've seen loads of people do, like, loads of these and get basically nothing, so I didn't have much hope. Oh my god, really? Wow. We get Turkish striker from. Uh, I, can't, I can't remember the name of the team. Uh, Yaziki. Yazik, ya. Ya. Yeet. Wow. Uh, yeah, not great. Not great. Um, not great. I really did think it'd be better than this, but if we can just get one walkout, I would be happy. To be fair, come on, walk out again. I'm just gonna skip it. Mm, really not good. Really, oh, Ogbonna though. Hey, yo, that's pretty cool. He probably doesn't go for a lot. He goes for 10,000 coins. It's just that pace, isn't it? It's just a bit too slow. He's got a good card otherwise, besides maybe stamina as well, but damn. Team we pack, two left to go. Two left to go, come on, please. EA, give us one walk out, please. Yes, we've got a walk out, come on. Come on. Belgium. Left mid. It's going to be Carrasco. Ooh, okay. Not the greatest one I could have got, but that's not terrible, actually. I do like his card, and obviously he's going to be quite good for the Rodrigo challenge. We have to score with La Liga players, so that's quite a good one to get. Untradeable. Can't complain. Can't complain with that. He does go for... He goes for 30,000 coins. That's mental. Wow, that's mental. What's bad on his card then? I mean, he's got good dribbling, got okay passing. He's got good shooting for a left wing, left mid. Obviously, a you know a hunter or whatever kind of shooting chemistry chemistry style would boost that up. Um, stamina's not bad. Strength is obviously a bit bit weak, but it is what it is. I actually see what's too terrible too terrible about about his card, unless he's just being packed so often with all the uh, flash SBCs and what have you. And all the lightning rounds, but last one, we did get a walkout, so I suppose I can't complain. Can we get back to back? No, didn't think so. EA was being far too generous, giving us a walkout, uh, and we get Mateta, Mateta. Cool. All right, so we're just going to end today off with some packs. Uh, I, you know, I'm falling into the trap again, but we're going to do a couple of those one, two, five K packs. Get some players in the club, hopefully. Get something half decent, you know, 125k packs, you'd expect something half decent. Um, but we'll see what we get. 
you know, as the uh, the Team of the Week packs were fairly garbage, we'll just do some of these, see how it goes. Of course, there's only a limited amount being a lightning round. First lightning round of FIFA 21. Can we start off with something good? Nope, it is boards though. Who are we going to get today? Spanish. Left back. Wow, Grimaldo. 84. 84 rated. Get a few 83s as well. Cancelo, Munayin. So I suppose it's not the worst pack in the world, but Jesus, wow. Just a whole lot of garbage. <laughs> Just a whole lot of garbage. Come on, EA. Give us a walkout. Last one today. Last pack of this video. Can we finish it with a walkout? No, we can't. These were a complete waste of money. You know, you try your best and sometimes you just don't succeed. But uh, you know the saying, it, you know, you get what you get. It is what it is, isn't it? It is what it is. Packs just aren't rewarding. And uh, I don't know. It, it really it really goes into good stead for Team of the Year when, like, uh, they're, like they're doing these two-week promos. Or supposedly, I mean, th this one I think is just going to be a one-week being Black Friday, but they might make it a two-week one, and obviously with the two-week ones, they release like five cards, then five more cards instead of what they used to do in previous FIFAs, where they'd release a team of a, of 11 or 13 cards, um, and you'd actually have a fairly good chance of getting one, and um, I, rem I remember back to FIFA 17 when they had like Man of the Matches and stuff, and they had a full team of these, like Team of the Tournament cards and whatever, and it was, uh, you know, you'd see them kind of packs like left, right, and centre, and obviously... I don't see a problem with that because, you know, FIFA is meant to be about fun, you know, and you meant you, you want to play with the best cards. And, and most most of the time, especially now of FIFA is like 19, 20 going onwards from like FIFA 17. They've just made it more and more impossible to get the more exclusive cards, icons being one of those. And uh, more often than not, you know, you, you play the game and you probably won't ever get to try out, you know, like the higher end, like Messi's, Ronaldo's, high icons, unless you've got like a loan. Uh, it's just it's just a bit sad really it's just a bit sad how they're just limiting uh, limiting the ability in this game it's just it's just really sad but it is it is what it is you know um i might try and do some of those 81 triple upgrades or, or what have you and then i might have a video if i can actually do some of those but you know coins are limited and i don't want to spend all my coins doing those packs because they are untradeable at the end of the day so you probably won't get anything that great um, it just seems like a bit of more of a player and coin sink, so maybe I'll give those a bit, a bit of a miss. But uh, either way, hopefully you have enjoyed today's video. I know it's been a bit, a bit crap, but um, you know, I hopefully have enjoyed nonetheless. Um, if you have, please do drop it a like. That'd be very, very much appreciated. If you want to see more of this content or become part of the exclusive family, if you enjoy, enjoy what we do around here, please do consider hitting that subscribe button. That'd be very, very much appreciated. But with that said. For today, hopefully you have enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you next time.